you get a mixture of kids from every different um, kind of living situation who grew up with drugs, who grew up with alcohol, mixing with kids who have no idea about it and who want to learn about it and who think it's cool, who have seen shows that um, introduce it to them. And all that gets mixed into high school and they all just try it, basically, at one point or another. Most kids do. My parents lived their lives as teens too. They weren't always parents. They weren't always just cooped up like talking to each other, trying to figure out what's for dinner. They were going out, having fun with their friends, doing whatever too. I have never been in a situation where I've been forced or peer pressured into it, but there is a kind of tone where they expect you to kind of give in and, uh, you know, come over to the dark side and try these types of, types of things. And um, as, a, as a student and as a teenager who's really kind of against that, that entire scenario, it is, you're almost looked down upon when you decide to stay on the straight and narrow or whatever um, you want to call it. But um, there is a kind of a, a tone of almost not disappointment, but kind of like where like you're not as good as they are because you don't do drugs or, or drink. I think it was actually seventh grade. Um, me and my best friend Lexis at the time. We were in her house and her sister is in high school and she was drinking with all her friends and everything and they were telling us how cool it is and how we should just try one. I didn't take anything because I, I knew better and um, she, I don't think she did either, it was so long ago, but they were just like pressuring us to do it. My mom are really close. She's like one of my best friends. Um, we talk about like everything. 
like she was telling me one time um she had one experience with weed and when she was in college she um tried smoking it once and she didn't like the way it made her feel so she never did it again but she tells me stories like how she drank she, how when she was little she drank on weekends but like she told me like bad stories about it too like how it led to like worse situations uh well my my mom and i are really close and she's always been honest with me about everything um she talked to me about what she did as a teenager and how it affected her life and um she pretty much told me that she hopes that i would make better choices and that i would be a better person than she was and that if I choose to do things like that I could lead a better life and that's what she hoped for me. So my mom really being honest with me and having a conversation instead of an argument really helps that situation. situations where I've watched friends or family members or people that I love and care about go down those kind of paths and have ruined their entire lives and I realized that I have big goals and I have big dreams and drugs and drinking is going to ruin that for Um, parents should really, they shouldn't drill their kids like they do. Like, I know, for example, I've seen multiple of my friends just drilled. Just like, where were you? What were you doing? And if parents like give their kids a leisure kind of a little leeway they can if they just like have a conversation as opposed to just drilling them just ask simple questions like um, to get a little feel for what's going on